Elsewhere, traders in Embu town woke up to a rude shock after they found their stores missing and stock scattered all over. The angry traders marched to county enforcement offices to demand answers on what they termed as gross violation of their basic human rights and destruction of livelihoods. There was drama in Embu town as traders forcefully picked their stands that had been confiscated by county government enforcement officers. The traders burned tires and barricaded a road leading to the market. As a show of their anger, they appealed to the county government to stop harassing them, bearing in mind the hard times worsened by the corona pandemic. <laughs> Members of the county assembly of Embu condemned the act and asked the county government to use dialogue as opposed to force when dealing with traders. They observed that there was poor planning within markets in Embu, an issue they said should be addressed as a matter of urgency. Kirimari MCA Maurice Nyaga noted that with the corona pandemic, it is not the best time to demolish stands of the traders. Kwa hivyo ningeomba serikali ya county government of Embu, eh, 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 department of trade, waangalie masoko yetu. Kama kuna mikakatu wanavaa kupanga pale, waende wapange watu yetu. Usipate yule mtu wanaripa rent ya nyumba, amezingirwa petana ni mtu wa kiosk na wanauza eh, bitha moja. Iyo ndio inaleta hii migogoro yote na ndiyo naona... He expressed concerns that the Marikiti market, which was set ablaze early this year, has been allocated to four individuals who have title deeds and will follow up to find out how they got title deeds for public land. Marikiti ni shamba moja na ni shamba ya county government of Embu. Na wezi tuambio kuna title deed yako kando juu ya title deed ya county government wewe ulitoa title deed wapi watu watano walitoa title deed wapi ya marikiti Suleimani Yeri Channel 1 News